Shakespeare's plays are performed in the five actions, first exploring, then conflict, action rising, climax, falling action, and denouement. These are the five actions that took in the Shakespeare's play. And question is asked like this. Uh, Elizabethan dramatics imitates the play by structure, the action into the five actions. Roman plays are in five actions to the pink pink phonics channel as well as today i will be starting elizabethan periods question answers as well as the depth in knowledge and the every aspect of that couldn't be asked and i will try to make pyqs as well as questions in that and it will be a contained 25 lectures and in that as well as you wanted more information in audio lectures than telegram where i can connect with you and you never know know which thought of my make you change your life so stay tuning with me and i will start uh, encyclopedias are good help of that and i will try to explain the points read the every point and uh, you will just stay connected with my lectures and uh, my maybe your uh, doubts and uh, your knowledge will be enhanced and uh, so from now elizabethan Elizabethan is Rani. Okay, we everyone know very well because recently she was died. But we are not going talking about Elizabethan II. We are talking about Elizabethan one. Our Elizabethan era is an epoch to be an Tudor period. Our Tudor period के बारे में हम जा रहे the Tudor period of the history of England. In the Tudor period, there is a between the 1485 to 1603 and include the Elizabethan period. During the reign of Elizabethan, the Tudor period considered the dynasty of House of Tudor and the England and it begins with the reign King Henry VII. King Henry VII is the father of Elizabethan and historical John Gray 1988 argued that England was an economy economical health most expensive and Tudor dynasty, Tudor dynasty or the house of Tudor was a royal house of Wales origin and it was in first monarchy it was Henry VII, his descendant thought through his mother of legitimate branch of English royal house of Lancaster. Henry VII is called start kiya tha, fir Henry VIII. Henry VIII, Edward VI, and Mary I and Elizabethan. It was then founded in the 1457 and ended at the 1603 Tudor dynasty. At the time of these monarchs, there is a time of Christianity religion, and the Christian is uh, Christian religion was so effective, and Christian religion is divided into two factors such as Catholics and Puritans, and both are like uh, in the other religions are also the every religion has the two domains. जैसे मुस्लिम ईसाई और जैन सभी है ना अपने अपने संप्रदाय में बटे हुए होते हैं हम सब कास्ट के अंदर वैसे इस मुस्लिम से होते हैं जो सुनी और सिहा में और जैन स्वेतांबर और दिगंबर जैन धर्म के दो प्रमुख संप्रदाय हैं उसके अंदर बटे हुए उसी प्रकार से क्रिश्चियनिटी में भी प्योरिटन्स एज वेल एज कैथोलिक्स आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ संप्रदाय और दैट Elizabethan area is where Tudor dynasty ki rani thi, thi And during the reign of the Queen Elizabethan I, 1558 to 1603, historical often depict it as in Golden Age. Golden Age kyu kaha gaya hai? So it was called Golden Age because it is a period consists peak in the history and contains uh, it is a peak at is and period considered the peak in the history of a country of people and it is a time period when the great achievement are mad and term originated from the early greek and roman poets who used to reference the time and when mankind live in a better time and pure and in a good facilities and everything was been enforcing and at that time the uh, people are uh, writing poetry as well as or uh, they are traveling all over the world and finding new places finance and business are rising high on the peak that's why it is known as, uh, as golden age and golden age in the literature why we read it because it at that time highest qualitative as well as quantity of poetry and work of literature was right and uh, 
published and the symbol of Britannia the symbol of Britannia Britannia means a female Britannia is a nation personified Britannia is a national personification of British as hermited female warrior hold a trident and sealed a image first used in classical antiquities and the latin britannia was the stuff okay was and first used in the 1572 so the britain time tha 1558 to 1603 1558 to 1603 that's why after thereafter the make the elizabethan age as in renaissance that inspires national pride nationality ko provoke karti thi through the classical ideas and international expansions and newell the timf over the spain newell the timf over the spain this is a golden age and present the opposite of the english renaissance and so following of the poetry music and literature the era is the most famous for its theater and its Shakespeare poetry sonnets and plays and many other composed plays that broke free of england past style of the theater it was the age of expansion and expansion abroad while and back at the home and protest uh, protestant reformation protestant reformation means had reformation was a major the movement in the western christianity christianity may reform hua tha kyunki yahan par puritans ki jagah christian uh, uh, puritans christianity ko provoke kiya ja raha tha uh, christianity catholics ko provoke kiya ja raha tha european that posed a religious and political challenge to the catholic church and the in the part it also pose a general to be an paper authority and reform marked the state of protestantism and the western church jo church ke do part kiye the henry second ne jisme puritans ne apne religions ko kattar tarah se like christianity ko apnaya tha to unhone at the time of the elizabethan they have left and they went to the geneva or german i think and it was the time when the Catholics are in the power, but uh, Ali the Bethan not provoke any Christianity out of these Puritans and Catholics. She uh, provoked the nationality and she has uh, also provoked uh, uh, traitor and many reformations are done. Matlab, ko badla gaya, unko punravit kiya gaya construction kiya gaya like maramat ki gayi bhot chijo ki and then the later conflict of the english civil war english civil war kiske beech mein hua tha to english civil war was between the political machination between the royalist parliament in the kingdom of england 1642 ke andar hua tha aur 1652 tak raha the part widely in the 1639 to the 53 war of the three kingdoms are struggle consider the England war and they are like uh just may Cromwell Vagera, so Parliament's co power mil gay thi. So it was in 1642 or Queen Gata time for 1603 the year. So her she was an the English civil war refers to the series of civil war and political machination between the royalist and parliament in the kingdom of England and 1642 to the 1651 the part of uh, winter and the 1639 to the 1653 war of the three kingdom the struggle consists of first english civil war and second english civil war and the third english civil war later it was being anglo scottish war known by that and the fighting took uh, place in the scot uh, scotland may uh, a place waiting and that's uh, all and then Elizabethan age is and contained the same with and previous and following reigns and it was a brief period of internal peace between the war of rose war of rose kya hai to iske baare mein samjho war of rose is like 1455 se 1487 tak 1455 se 14 uh, uh, 14 
55 से था और ये एलिजाबेथन का टाइम है 1558 टू 1603 तो 1455 का टाइम नोमेंस थे ओके और वॉर ऑफ रोज किसके टाइम हुआ नोमेडियंस के टाइम हुआ था ओके और वॉर ऑफ रोज प्लेस टेक प्लेस इन द 1455 टू द 1487 नोन एट द टाइम फॉर द मोर देन सेंचुरी आफ्टर द सिविल वॉर वॉर इज सीरीज ऑफ सिविल वॉर्स and over control of English throne in the middle to the late 15th century and these wars were fought between the support of two rival cadet branch of branch of rivals and in that in that uh, there are you know, cadet branch of royal house of Plantagenet and Lancaster and uh, York Lancaster and York and uh, it is the war extinguished the later main line of the house of Lancaster and is kya hua ki jo york aur lancasters ke beech mein fighting hui thi aur ye place thi ye place thi ireland ke andar aur yahan par battle hua tha between twickburn twicksburg ke beech mein 15th century and the war of roses was happen theek hai yaad rakhna 1455 mein hua tha okay aur no man ke time pe ye bhi yaad rakh sakte hain theek hai ab war of roses ke baad mein uh, less, uh, next to is an English reformation and is when uh, English language may be dialect change hua tha. so you must need about to be dialects which are most popular at that and how dialect formed and English civil, civil war and uh, ongoing of the political battle between the parliament and the monarchy that included the remains the religious settlement and the parliament was not yet strong enough to and challenge the royal absolute and England was also well off compared to the other nation of Europe and the Italian Renaissance had come to an end following the end of Italian wars which left the Italian punishful and improvised the kingdom of French was mean enrolled in the French war of religious and the 1562 and 1598 they were being temporarily settled in the 1598 by an policy of totaling uh, pro totaling protestantism protestantism with an addict of nantes in the part which of this but also because the english had been explained from their last outpost on the content by spain tertius and the centuries long and low french war war mean largely suspended the most of uh, most of Elizabethan rings are the one great revival was being Hubri work. Habsburg, Spain, with whom the England is enclashed in, in Europe and America, in the skirmishes that explored into the Anglo Spanish War of the 1585 to the 1604, and attempted by Philip II of Spain to invent the England with an Spanish Armada. So, Spanish Armada was in 1588. 1588. Spanish Armada also known by the Invincible Armada or Enterprise of England, which is a It was fought between the England and Philip II of Spain and it was been sealed up with the English channels joined with the Duke of Parma. It is in Flanders or the northern portion of Bel Belgium and one of the community of religious and it is scored and in force that been over, would land in the England over through the Elizabethan one and which was been proposed to be and restrain the Catholics in the England and support for the Duke Republic and prevent attack by 
English dukes and uh, provide as a private person or an vessel that uh, engages uh, in the maritime welfare under the commission of the war and the seas the robbery under the arms was a common aspect of that time and as well as this is in northern sea and Scotland and Ireland uh, are the uh, wives of Spanish and its background England has been strategy in alliance with an Spain for many decades the period had been contained the well organized and effective government and largely the result of the uh, reform of the Henry VII and Henry VIII as well as the Elizabethan has punishment for any descendant and economically the country begins to be a benefit and greatly from the view of era trans atlantic jo log punishment mein the jo log prison mein the un logo ko ek chance mila to live their life they have went to the uh, trans atlantica to find new places and trade and persistence and thereafter the spanish has been protagonist in treasury and jo uh, protestant se और एज वेल एज स्पेनिश थे जो पुर्तगाली थे और ट्रेजरी ढूंढी उन्होंने और मोस्ट ऑफ आर नो टेबल एंड रिजल्ट ऑफ फ्रेंच ड्रैक क्रीमिकेशन ये है फ्रेंच ड्रैक क्रीमिकेशन आर ऑल्सो नोन एज अ ड्रैक रीडिंग एक्सपेंडिशन वॉज एन इम्पोर्टेंट हिस्टोरिकल मिली टाइम एंड इवेंट एंड टू प्लस बिटवीन द फिफ्थ डिसम्बर फिफ्टीन सेवेंटी सेवन आफ्टर द एलिजाबैथ इन टाइम एट द टाइम ऑफ हु एट द टाइम ऑफ इंटरगम ऑफ इंटरगम ऑफ जैकोबियन टाइम और द एलिजाबैथन पीरियड और द रेस्टोरेशन टाइम ऑफ इंटरगम पीरियड के टाइम में एंड इट वॉज इन सिक्सटीन सेप्टेम्बर फिफ्टीन एंड एट द टाइम ऑफ रेस्टोरेशन ऑलमोस्ट एंड रेस्टोरेशन आने वाला था बट इट वॉज नोन एज अ टाइम ऑफ इंटरगम एंड द एक्सपेंडिशन वॉज बीन एथोराइज बाय द क्वीन एलिजाबैथन वन एंड कंसिडर द फाइव शिप्स लीड बाय द फ्रेंच ड्रीक और फ्रेंच डिक्स द सम टर्म्स एलिजाबैथन वॉज बीन ऑलरेडी वेल इस्टाब्लिश इन द इंग्लिश ब्रिटिश हिस्टोरिकल कॉन्सियसनेस एंड लॉन्ग बिफोर द एक्सटेंशन ऑफ द इंग्लिश एलिजाबैथन सेकेंड एंड जनरली रेफर्स एज द सोलरली टू बी एन टाइम ऑफ द अर्लियर क्वीन ऑफ दिस नेम एंड दिस वॉज एन इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ एलिजाबैथन टाइम वेर नेक्स्ट वी आर टॉकिंग next is about the introduction of bible translation as well as the hermeneutics where we discuss about